Hey guys, my name is Ibration, and in today's video guys, I want to discuss about how you, yes you, can now go ahead and make your own VR game very easily. For the longest time, there haven't been many ways of making a Roblox VR game. And yes, there are YouTubers like Epic Game 59 who has an amazing tutorial on how to make a Roblox VR game. And then there's also people like Nexus VR. And these two sources are amazing. But recently, I was scrolling around YouTube and found this. It's called How to Set Up New VR Kit in Roblox Studio. And this kit does not disappoint. Essentially, if you've ever played uh, Roblox's Oppressor VR, then this kit is exactly that. And, well, it is exactly that because the developers of that game have decided to make their old version public. And this is crazy. Because with this kit, you are, giving, you are given so much to work with. You're given things like guns, melees, special items, doors, buttons, and even a VR chat. And you're also given a multi-platform. And what that essentially means is that PC players can, act can interact with VR players and VR players can interact with PC players. And in my opinion, that's just crazy that they would give it all, you know, out like that because, you know, Roblox VR game development is very hard. It's time consuming. And I mean, it's just hard because Roblox, I mean, sure, it gives you tools and assets. It teaches, it gives you some stuff. But to be honest, it there's not much on the it, there's not much on the doc documentation. So do make sure to go check out, you know, Oppressor VR. Give it a like, favorite it, and all that good jazz, and you know, play it. It's honestly a whole lot of fun. And also make sure to uh, like and subscribe to the other guy. Uh, all links will be down in the description below. Um, but you know, I just want to talk about what wh what's the next step for Roblox's VR future. If you know me, I love VR. You know, when I saw Bone Lab getting released, I was like, hell yes, Bone Lab. Hopefully, a successor to Boneworks. You know, you know how it turned out. Um, but you know, with Roblox getting ported to Quest 2, and I mean ported, but I think essentially Roblox giving support to Quest 2 officially now. Um, you know, I think is crazy because you know. Roblox VR game player counts have, you know, increased by a whole lot, and I mean, it's honestly just mind-blowing and how, you know, how crazy it is, um, and so I hope with this VR kit that more people are going to give it a try, um, you know, more people are going to try developing the game, and, you know, hopefully there's going to be more Roblox VR games, because, I mean, why wouldn't there just be? Roblox is such a nice way to get into coding and it's so easy to learn and stuff like that and so i hope that with this kit we'll hopefully be able to see more high quality roblox VR games out there and stuff like that but that's gonna be it for this video guys i know it's a short one but i just had to let everybody know that roblox vr game development just got a little bit easier again make sure to go support oppressor vr and is cuba uh, like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one